Hi, this is Bob Hampton with Bilo Sales and Service. We're making this quick little video in case you've bought a lawnmower at uh, a, another place and they didn't take the time to show you the details and the facts of what you needed to do, or if you've never been on a zero turn. Uh, this is just some of the things that we try to help customers with at our store at 733 North Magnolia here in Ocala, Florida. Uh, start with, if you've never been on one of these, when you come in, you bring the arms in, you got your RPMs up on the engine, and the further forward you go, the faster you go. And then back, slow down, pull back, is a stop. Now one of the things that I teach is you, if you're gonna do a hard turnaround, and this is one of the things that's very crucial, come to a stop, feel it back just a little bit as you feel it go back, pull your, if you're gonna make a left hand turn, pull your left handle back and your right handle forward, but pull it way back when you go. Or if not, you'll lock the rear wheel down. And at the time you lock the rear wheel down, you'll probably leave a divot hole. If you have a zero turn and you've been mowing with it because somebody sold you this video, this, this mower, and just told you to go out in the middle of the yard and start and you learn how to mow it, you're starting to find these little divot holes in your yard everywhere you turn around. The reason for that is it's on your inside handle. You're not pulling it back. So therefore, the, the inside turn your inside wheel is not reversing. Your right one is going forward, your left one is not. It's just locking. So therefore, it's like you're planting your heel and spinning around. You're just making a hole in your yard. Um, you need to get out of that habit. If you have a problem, come see me down at Bilo's. I don't charge you nothing. I'll put you on the more and I'll help you and we'll get you right through that. Another common mistake is, is a lot of people goes to the end of the yard and then just pulls the left stick back instead of coming to a stop. And when that happens, the left rear wheel just starts spinning and finally it comes to a stop and makes a turn. And all you're doing is burning your grass up. Uh, hopefully these little tips right here will, will help save your yard and also make it very much fun and interesting to learn to uh, be able to use your zero turn in the most efficient way. And any questions, please call me at Bilo 732-4358. Thank you for viewing this tape.